Peace and blessings. Welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to be teaching you how to make mop water. I'm in cleanup mode today, but I decided to share this because I know that somebody needs to know. So with no further ado, let's get started. Okay, for starters, the first thing I have here is my mop water. Okay, it's not filled up. <coughs> the chemicals are causing me to cough a little bit, and that does happen. That's why, as you can see, I have my bathroom window open because I have my bleach undone for the video. So that's what's causing me to cough. But anyway, the first thing I like to do, I'm going to do the bleach first so that I can cap it back up so I can breathe better, okay? Okay, so this is bleach. And I'm using great value concentrated bleach, so you don't need much. Okay, so I'm just going to pour a little of that into the mop water. Okay, I'm happy I'm done with that. I can cap that up. Next up, I have one of my favorite, and that's Fabulosa. I'm using the... This is the lavender scented Fabuloso. And I like to pour a good bit in there because I like to clean in a way that when you open your front door after cleaning the next day or later, that wonderful fragrance can just hit you in the face. Okay, now this one, I saved the best for last. This is Florida water. Florida water is a very spiritual water. Adding a little to your mop water will bless your home. It will give your home a happy feeling, a sense of joy and peace and happiness. And when you mop your water, when you make your, when I make my mop water, I like to mop with intention. I like to pray over my mop water. Just say a little prayer. Or I like to mop with intention. Like I'm cleansing my house, and so this makes it spiritual cleaning, okay? Okay, so I did more than a drop there, okay? And so then I'm going to show you the type of mop. I'm going to set this mop water aside. And I'm going to show you my mop. This is the mop that I like to use. This is a ringer mop. This is an evergreen ringer mop. And let's open that up. The reason why I like to mop with this type of mop, these microfiber fibers are excellent for cleaning dirt and catching everything. And this ringer mop, you don't need a bucket with a ringer because this is going to catch the excess water. When you're done, you use this two-hand operation, and you just do that, and it wrings out all the water. This is brand new, so it needs to be all wet. And if you follow these instructions, you will have clean floors that smell good, and your home will smell good. So if you like this video, and you learned something, I want you to like, share, and subscribe and also leave in the comments below how you mop what do you like to put in your mop water because I don't know everything I want to continue learning forever so if there's something special that you like to add always feel free to let me know I welcome comments so like share and subscribe and I will see you in the next video bye for now